Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to learn calculating percentages over hierarchies in DAX. First I have imported this US Superstore data and uh, you know how you can import uh, this data set using the uh, file option and then I have created this total sales measure. This is a simple total sales measure. This is sum of uh, this our sales value. Okay. Now, what is our purpose? I want to create this type of report. What is that report? In our data set, if we have some hierarchical information, what is hierarchical information? For example, product. Okay product we have one category information then subcategory information then product detail level information so in this data set i have this category information subcategory information and as well as product name information so i have created one product hierarchy based on this category subcategory and product name okay now i have sales value i want to calculate how this sales value is related to each and every hierarchical level. For example, this category furniture has some total sales. Then for the subcategory under this furniture, how this percentage has been divided among this uh, subcategory value as well as the product level value. So for that uh, in tax, there is no straightforward calculation formula for this hierarchical calculation, but we can use different functions to calculate these um, measures. So first, what I have done, I have created three separate measures. What are those three measures I have created? I have first created this percentage on category. You can observe this is simple uh, calculate function. I have used that and simple divide function and all selected. All selected is one kind of a filter function you know already. So uh, in this uh, measure, I am passing this subcategory value and this is a calculation based on this category. Okay, where my filter condition is subcategory. Similarly, when I am calculating percentage on subcategory, I have used divide function within that divide function this is my total cells because at first I have created this total cells function and comma this calculate where total cells within the bracket all selected this product name that means my subcategory percentage value is calculated based on this product name as a filter condition okay then I have this percentage on total where I am passing this category information in the filter condition. So these three measures are providing me the percentage value based on three different level. Okay. Now I have created one matrix view. We know that matrix view. In that matrix view, I have added this product hierarchy. So whenever you are adding this product hierarchy, you will get all the fields like category, subcategory and product name. So I'm just removing this product name. If you want, you can add those also. But uh, I'm using uh, only this two uh, field here. Now I've added the total cells. First percentage total. What is percentage total? This is based on our category level. Now I have this uh, percentage on category. So that means it's based on our subcategory level and this percentage on subcategory. So it's our pro providing the data percentage based on our product level. Now when I've added that, I can observe for the furniture, I'm getting some percentage value. But for the other value, it's completely only 100 and 100. Whereas if I move to this level, here also I'm getting 100% but uh, all other values are also divided because this is based on the subcategory level data. But uh, whenever I'm looking into this report, I'm not getting any proper output. Okay, so every time like 100 and 100 is completely useless. 
So how will I solve this problem? There is one uh, function is there that is is in scope. Okay, that is a information function in tax. Okay, how we can use that is in scope function to calculate only one measure, only one percentage measure, and which will solve our problem in this calculation hierarchical data. Okay, what I have done. I have created one separate measure. I'll just go through this measure. Okay. So first, I have uh, declared one variable that is current sales. Current sales is nothing but our total sales value. Then I have declared one variable that is subcategory sales. Okay. So just look into that function. Like I use a simple calculate function, total sales and all selected on this product name. So in this measure. Whenever I am declaring all this variable, I am just going to uh, from the product level, then subcategory, then category. So you have to do this approach. Okay. So I have this product name, and similarly, I have declared another variable category cells. This is calculate within the calculate function. I am using total cells and subcategory information. Similarly, for this is our total cells where I am. Adding this category as our hierarchical level, and this is my final variable where I'm calcul uh, calculating this percentage value. Within that percentage value, I'm using if is in scope, is in scope, always returning a true value. It's a boolean uh, returns. Okay, so if this function is getting one uh, data. Within that, uh, whenever they are passing any column information, if they are getting any uh, data, so it will pass true. Then it will move to the next uh, loop condition. So, if is in scope, getting this column value, and uh, then comma divide this current cells and subcategory cells that means in the divide function i am using current cells divided by the subcategory cells this is my subcategory cells information then if again i am using is in scope and i am passing this category information okay so if they are getting any category data then it will do this division okay then again i am doing uh, calculating this percentage value if is in scope category information then it will divide the current cells divided by the total cells so this is a normal uh, formula if you go through microsoft uh, document for this function you will find out this type of methods already mentioned there how we can calculate percentage value for hierarchical data okay finally i am returning the ratio of percentage okay so uh, if you go through my blog you can find out all the steps how i have created all those things okay i'm okay. now using this function i have created one report i will show you for example um, i have selected here this is the same matrix report okay i'm uh, using this uh, product hierarchy then this total cells and finally this percentage all level data. Now we can observe this furniture category showing 32%, 32.3%. Within that bookcases, chairs, furniture, furnishing tables, they are also under this category or this subcategory. Okay. Similarly, if I click on this, for example, click on this bookcases, you can observe each and every product also I'm getting the percentage. It's not showing all, everything is 100 and 100. Okay, So it's calculating the data based on their hierarchical level. So this one measure solve our problem for calculating percentage value over hierarchical levels. I hope you understood how you can solve this type of problem whenever you are getting any hierarchical information and you have to represent this percentage value. If you have any doubt and how you want to create all those things, please follow my blog. All the steps are mentioned there. Also, in the description section, I have provided the 
working files thank you thanks for watching